I'm Francesco Corti, product evangelist. Uh, I have a challenge today in doing things, because doing that talk, because I have to also to take a video, and it, it is an interaction, an interactive lighting talk. So, uh, do do you know what an a product evangelist is, and uh, especially what a product or the or developer evangelist do in Alfresco? Who kn who, who knows what a product evangelist is? Raise your hand, please. Okay, nice, nice. So for sure it's not so spiritual like my friend is, uh, and uh, it's not some, something connected to uh, free hugs and tree hugs, uh, it's something a little bit more specific, and I will try to discuss it a little bit more with you. So, the core concept about developer evangelism is uh, the developer uh, in the community is a technical or a former developer, not a former in this case, and an aptitude for communication. In Alfresco this means uh, that uh, uh, improve the developer experience, helping developers to the adopt uh, Alfresco. These are some key concepts of the role of the developer evangelist and the product evangelist. The main task and activity of the product evangelist and a developer evangelist is talks, article, blogging, demonstration and sample of projects, webinar, for example, like we do uh, with Kristen and with other guys of the organization. So, this is the typical life cycle of a product evangelist, so creating content, publishing, socializing, listen, socializing too much, someone tell me. <laughs> listen, interact, feedback, refine things. But today, I would like to, to do something with you guys. So I would like to focus on listen, interact, and feedback. And honestly, I would like to play a little bit, guys, be, 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 pay attention now, huh? And uh, so what, 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 what I mean, so let's play a game together. So each of the next slides is a, is a question. So please raise your hand uh, for the yes and uh, put your hands down for no. So please pre prepare your hands because I will get a film. Then I will show the results uh, uh, on a blog post later on. Are you ready, guys? Okay, this is the, the first question. So let's raise the first question. Let me say if you are alive. Okay, thank you guys. So let's see the next question together. Can you see how difficult this is lies in talk? Can you imagine? Okay, the next question is, uh, are you a developer or do you work on technical stuff? Uh, yes, you are developer, you are technical. Do you work with Alfresco for more than three years? Guys, you are an experienced developer of Alfresco. Nice. So, question number four. Did you find easy to get your question answered? <laughs> I love these questions. <laughs> I love, really love these questions. So, que uh, question number six. I have extra time, guys. I can talk about my life. <laughs> oh, five, okay. Did you find it easy to start? Sorry, sorry, sorry. No. Uh, are you happy with the current level of information around ADF? <laughs> Okay, you are not happy, guys. You're yes, here. Yeah. So, are you happy with the current information around REST API? <coughs> REST API seems to be well covered. And uh, question number eight. Uh, question. Okay, are you happy with the current information around the search services? I don't say the ac acronym. Hmm, not so happy. At the moment, REST API wins. So, uh, we are close to the end. Are you happy with the current level of information around activity? No one's happy. <laughs> <laughs> no, you don't work with activity. No, no, I know you. <laughs> so, the last question is, do you have in mind a, a suggestion to cover a gap? You don't have? <laughs> No, guys, this is, this is, okay, I like you, I like you. I will cut to you. So, first of, 
Thank you very much. This is my. This is what my friends say, and this is like life's question. If you don't ask for something for sure, you won't have it. So please, guys, come to me and tell me what do you want from me? Because I want to know what you want from me. Thank you.